y'all, welcome back. Thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to check out another one of my videos. Today we have Little Miss Missy Poo here, which means I'm filming a little bit earlier than day, and as you guys saw by the title, I'm doing a word test. So that's why this one's making an appearance. Today is going to be a word test on a Tardis lip paint in the color Delish that I got in my boxy charm. What are we saying? Ooh. I don't think she likes my makeup today. I had uh, several of y'all ask me if I could do a wear test on this and I've been very curious to see how it does during a good, you know, four and eight hour uh, time span. So uh -huh. we're gonna do it today. And I actually had a little mishap in the, the cover broke. So um, I wasn't even tightening it very hard, but I went to tighten it to close it one day and it just snapped. So that's why I wanted to hurry up and do this wear test so that we can see what the formula is like before it changes. Because unless you guys have any like uh, thoughts and opinions on what I can do, I think I'm just gonna have to toss it after this because the 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 caps broke. I'll show you when I, I get a close up or when we zoom in to do the application. But yeah, I was pretty bummed. Anyway, so let's go ahead and zoom in and get this applied. And we got story time today, so we gotta get cracking. All right, here's what it looks like, and as you can see, the lid is now cracked. <gasps> that was a car going by. I went to uh, tighten it one day, and I promise you, it was not tightening over tightening it, and I just went like this and. Bam, it cracked. Here's what the applicator looks like. It's got a little like doe foot with a scoop out in the middle. And this is, I forget if I told you, but in the color Delish. So let's just apply it to our lips. The time is now at 9.32. I feel like I only needed the one layer. I'm gonna stick in a close up. So I'll do another check in in four hours and we will just see how this holds up. So I'm really excited. I always hear very mixed things when it comes to the Tartiste, uh, Tartiste lip paints. Yeah, I think she's ready to go to story time. So I will see you all in four hours. All right, so I am back for my first check-in. It has been four hours. As you can see, it is 1.30, so, so pretty much right around um, the four hour mark. If my memory serves me correctly, we started this around at 9.30. Might be a few minutes shy here or there, but close enough. All right, so looking at my lips are really close in the mirror. I did want to touch on, I don't think I mentioned this in my last um, eight hour wear test for liquid lipstick, but my lips naturally start to wear away right in here and I don't think it has any fault to do with the lipstick because no matter if I'm wearing a liquid lipstick or just a regular lipstick the the color won't adhere to these parts and I think it's just the way that I talk kind of makes that more noticeable <laughs> because um, you can't tell as badly if I'm wearing a regular lipstick but for a dry matte non-transferring lipstick you can definitely tell and it's just honestly the way my lips move when I talk so I don't really take that into consideration when I'm doing a wear test because it's just the way my mouth is. I did want to say that I have been drinking uh, from a straw today and then I had a bar, I had a, a corn dog that was very careful when I ate and then I also had a little peanut butter and jelly sandwich. So that's all that I've really eaten today since putting this on and I have to say I am, I, I, I like the results that I have so far. Um, it, it's definitely a liquid lipstick that you can feel on your lips the whole time I've been wearing it um, They feel dry. They feel like I could kind of use a chat like a chapstick and I don't think I mentioned but these do tr dry down completely Completely matte don't transfer at all. I have a little bit of like Pilling that comes just a tiny bit at the corner of my mouth just from when eating and drinking and stuff like that um, Where it's kind of crumbled a little bit. I think you can see that in a close-up but um, honestly, it wasn't bad enough for me to feel like I had to go into the bathroom and like fix that. I just noticed that. And really, it's very minimal, especially compared to my last liquid lipstick wear test where it was doing that and bleeding into the edges of my lips really badly. But um, no, this looks great. It's maybe, maybe the color has worn away just a touch at the very center of my lips, but honestly, if I was out and about and I had, you know, met someone for lunch, and I was at the four hour wear mark and I you know, went to the bathroom and checked my lipstick, I wouldn't retouch or anything. So I'm not gonna retouch at this point. But yeah, I think that is all that I wanted to touch on. It's getting darker, I'm looking more and more warm. So we're just going to wrap this little check-in up and I will be back in another four hours to kind of wrap up this whole test and share my thoughts with you. But so far, I'm, I'm very happy with these Tartiste lip paints, so yeah. I will see you all very soon. All right, so it is the last check-in and with the time change, it gets really uh, dark very quickly, so I'm going to have to figure out something 
for future word tests, but we're gonna do this check-in, our final check-in, a little early. It's only been technically around seven and a half hours, but I have no light. I'm using some lamps, and I don't know how this is gonna turn out, and we need to move on with our day. I need to get dinner going. So we're just gonna do the check-in now, and final check-in, and give you my thoughts, because I'm pretty sure I, I have my feelings pretty set on this product. I do want to reapply this on camera hi, with you because I have hi, not today, hi, but this is how hi, it looks after hi. you saying hi. Seven and a half hours. I've been eating, but I'm very careful. Oh, she blew y'all kisses. I don't know if you'll be able to see this, but it's basically five o'clock. So as I said, only seven and a half hours, but let's zoom in and reapply. I am going to insert a close up real quick of what my lips look like before reapplying. All right, and there we go. I'm just gonna give it a little while to set. It does look like it kind of applied a little thicker. Like there's a, a few spots right here on the outer edges mostly where you can see the line of where it wore away and kind of bunched up right there, but not bad at all. All right, so here is what it looks like. I think it looks really nice. I don't think I mentioned, but uh, like I think once throughout the day I went to um, pat my lips because I got them a little wet and a tiny bit of color came off, but that's the only transfer I've seen all day. I like this formula. It's not the most comfortable. Now this is a type of liquid lipstick formula that I would say I'll probably have to pamper my lips tomorrow to kind of, you know, restore some moisture to them because they do feel dry. This is a type that you feel on your lips, but it's not super uncomfortable and it's not thick on your lips. It feels very thin. Now I would say around the oh, five hour mark, I was like, okay, you know, I feel like I want to take my lipstick off and just be done with it for today. But even still, I'm at, we're at seven and a half hours as I showed you at the beginning of the video and it still looks good in my opinion. And, uh, yeah, I could go with a couple more hours or at least, you know, one more meal and feel okay. And um, I feel like it isn't, you know, bunching up on my lips, lips weird. It still, you know, isn't transferring off anywhere. Um, and it looks really nice. I like the applicator, made it easy to apply. Um, it's very pigmented when you go to apply it. And I feel like there's no patchiness. It's very light on the lips. It's a very like liquidy texture. It's not thick or moussey, which I really do like. As you can see, um, so overall, it, this gets a thumbs up for me. I'm not mad at these. I know a lot of people, I heard a lot of mixed reviews um, about these when they first came out, but I find them nice. I'm really happy with the results, and I would wear this, you know, for an event going somewhere and feel really confident, and maybe I need to retouch a little bit in the center, but... That's honestly it, and it, it's just, it's not that bad. So. But I hope this review was helpful to you. I hope the wear test and the check-ins kind of helped you decide if this liquid lipstick might be worth checking out, if this uh, Tarte's line of liquid lipstick is worth it for you to check out and maybe purchase the color. Again, this is only in the color Delish. Maybe they're lighter or darker colors or streakier, worse, I don't know, but Delish was great besides the fact that it broke. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. Give it a thumbs up if you like these wear tests and let me know down in the comments below what liquid lipstick I should do an eight hour wear test on next. So thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.